hello everyone and welcome back to another adobe illustrator tutorial so in this tutorial we'll see how we can create this text effect in adobe illustrator so let's start the video let's remove everything from the artboard and i'll select my background layer and draw a simple rectangle i'll use these two colors for my background let's apply a default black and white linear gradient I'm using the color picker tool. You can use these codes. So here is my simple background. Let's lock our background layer and let's start creating our text effect. So the font I'm using for this text effect is grow bold and the font size will be 200 point let's center this to the artboard next click on this none to remove the fill color and then we'll go to appearance panel click on this icon add new fill after that keep selecting this fill layer and then we'll go to gradient panel let's apply default black and white gradient and i'm using this time radial gradient and let's change the colors I'll use these two colors for this layer. Again, I'm using color picker tool. You can use these codes. After that, let's again go to the appearance panel and keep selecting this fill layer and duplicate this layer two times. Now select our second layer, change the color to white and keep selecting the white layer. Then go to effect path and offset path apply a minus 2 pixel offset path and then click ok now select our first layer then go to effect path and offset path and apply a minus 3 pixel offset path and then click ok keep selecting our first layer then go to effect distort and transform and transform and here in move section apply a 4 pixel vertical value and then click ok next select this layer duplicate this layer now select this layer and let's change the color of this layer to this one then go to effect distort and transform and transform here in scale section apply a 99.9% .9 for horizontal and 99.9 .9 for vertical in move section apply a 0.5 pixel vertical value and we need 34 copies then click ok next keep selecting this layer duplicate this layer now select this layer click on this arrow then click on transform and here change the copies from 34 to 42 then click ok next click on opacity change the blend mode to multiply now click on this arrow to close property of this layer next select this layer duplicate this layer and let's change the color of this layer to black now go to effect distort and transform and transform here in move section apply a 28 pixel vertical value then click ok next drag this layer to bottom select this layer click on this arrow then click on opacity change the blend mode to multiply and change the opacity to 50 percent click on this arrow to close the property of this layer then select this layer duplicate this layer and this time let's change the color of this layer for this let's go to gradient panel and here we'll change the colors 
I'm using these two colors for this layer. Next, go to the appearance panel and click on effect, path and offset path. Apply a 34 pixel offset path and then click OK. Now select this layer, drag this layer to bottom. Again select this layer and go to effect, distort and transform and transform and here in move section apply a 14 pixel vertical value and then click OK. Next keep selecting this layer and duplicate this layer. Now select our last layer and then go to effect, distort and transform and transform click on apply new effect here in scale section apply a 99.9% .9 for horizontal and 99.9% .9 for vertical and in move section apply a 0 0.5 pixel for vertical and we need 100 copies then click OK next let's change the color I have already created this gradient if you want this gradient let me know in the comment section and I'll provide the link okay next let's duplicate this text and let's change our word okay here let's change the colors I'll use these colors for this text. Let's apply arc to our both text. For this, let's go to effect warp and then arc and we need 18% band here and then click OK let's apply the same to this text let's select the type then go to effect warp and arc and here we go so here is our final text effect look I hope you have learned something from this video. Please do like and subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching.